without cause, the Bible says, and that's the same as murder because he's checking our insides as well as our outsides. I looked at that standard one day and all of us, six billion of us are liars and thieves and blasphemers and adulterers and murderers by that standard, which means six billion of us would be guilty on Judgment Day and would mean hell unless God provided a way out. And so what's the difference about Jesus Christ as being the way out versus all those other religious figures I mentioned? Well, I, I don't believe that they're going to hell. I mean, you know, it's, everybody has to work out their own inner salvation. And I don't know their beliefs totally, but they, I can't answer that question. Well, and the I reason, no, you're, you're okay. Uh, because what hit me when I studied a bunch of religions a few years ago is when I studied them only, okay, uh, only out of all those religions that the blood of Jesus could wash you as pure and as white as snow and erase all your sins. Nothing in Islam could do it, nothing in Hinduism, nothing in Buddhism, nothing in Zoroastrianism. And I realized that was the answer. And then he backed it up three days later with the resurrection. Predicted his own death, predicted he was going to have a grave, and predicted he would rise from the dead. Muhammad didn't do it, Buddha didn't do it, Confucius didn't do it. And I realized I had the right answer. And then when he said, I'm the way, the truth, and the life, no one comes to the Father except me, that let me know without a doubt that this is the right answer that the world's looking for, whether they know it or whether they don't. And that's why we have to share that with them. Well, that is, that's the way I believe. Like I said, I don't know the other religions that well to, to know. And I'm assuming they don't believe that. You know, they believe other ways of entering into wherever the afterlife they go. But as far as I believe, it's, it is uh, through Jesus Christ's blood. Uh, are you a reader? Do you like to read? Uh, not much. No, I don't read much. Eddie, <laughs> you're standing in front of a famous author, Eddie. I want to sign one of my books and give you one of my books. I'll read it. If I sign one, you'll read it? I'll read it. Well, you, if you don't sign it, I'll read it. <laughs> hey, I just want to thank, thank you, Eddie, so much for your help. Uh, You're very welcome. Stuff like that, okay? Thank you. Thank you very much, okay? Thank you.